Natasha coming to you guys with another styling video but today it's going to be all about the infamous trench coat so if you were deciding if you wanted to get the trench coat or not I'm about to help you make that decision okay so like I said I picked up a trench coat from ASOS this trench coat is so nice and the price point is chef kiss like it's really inexpensive this is my first trench coat now i'm in love i'm still on the hunt for the perfect trench like i got like a light tan but i really want more so like of like that dark um khaki like almost olive color i feel like that would fit my wardrobe best overall so if you're interested keep on watching if you're new hey boo my name is tasha i focus on fashion beauty and lifestyle mainly fashion if you are og thank you for continuing to be subscribed to me don't forget to follow me at tasha that be styles let's get into the video okay you guys so this is the first look i wanted to give you guys the look and then we'll talk about the trench so this is like very much streetwear i have on this leopard print bodysuit from boohoo i've had this for like two years i checked boohoo's website to see if it's still available and it's not and they didn't have anything comparable to it that looked nice everything else that they had on there looked kind of tacky but i'll see if i can find like another leopard print bodysuit if you guys are interested and then i have it paired with these distressed boyfriend jeans from fashion nova my white mules from now west and i tied in the white belt and my chanel bag and my shades so this is a streetwear look but the trench is making it a little bit more elevated Okay, so let me got let me give you guys the details on the trench coat. I got this trench coat from ASOS, like I said, it's in a size 16. I'm gonna show you guys how big this is. Um, I'm typically a 16, 18 for reference. I'm 5'3. This trench coat is humongous. So I would say if you are a 16. 18 like myself that you could do a 14 maybe even a 12. so this is how much room i have this is how big the sleeves are so you can do like a chunky sweater under this like you definitely can layer this Ooh, no. The belt is stuck. But this is how it looks. Belt set. And it has like the tortoiseshell buttons. This is a linen and cotton blend trench. It does have pockets. So I like it more so tied back. I feel like tied back, it gives some shape, but this trench coat was only like $40 from ASOS. Like I said, this is my first trench and I didn't want to invest in one just in case I didn't know if I, you know, just because I didn't like it. But now that I know that I like it, I know how to order a trench coat now. But for the vibe, the aesthetic, I like this trench coat. And if you're like me and you've never had a trench coat before, I feel like this is the one to get before, unless you are going in store to try on a trench coat. If you're gonna order online, then like, I feel like this is the one to experiment with. I do wish that it had those um, cuff things here because I would prefer to be able to adjust it and be able to scrunch it. You guys know like I like doing that. So I'm not able to do it with that one unless I put maybe like a rubber band or something here to be able to hold it there. But for the aesthetic, it's a nice trench coat. Let me give you guys one more thing. Okay, 
Okay, so let's get into the second look. Okay, you guys. So I have on these satin joggers. I got these from H&M last year. I paired with the turtleneck, same white mules, and then we're gonna add the trench to it. This is like a real simple look, but we're playing around with texture. But the trench coat is going to really elevate this. And again, like I told you guys, I wish I could leave it scrunch. And then I just put the Chanel bag back with it. So you're gonna use a trench coat as like a focal piece of your outfit. It's gonna be like a staple. So you can really have a super basic wardrobe or outfit and the trench coat is going to be that um, the accessory that you need, like that purse, that necklace, that shade or whatever. That's what the purpose of the trench coat is for is to take you to the next level to look elevated or chic. Okay, you guys, so let's get into the next look. Okay, you guys, so my Shein package just came. And since there's only three items, I'm going to work it in this video. I picked up these loafers from Shein. As you guys know, loafers are very much on trend. I feel like these are giving like Gucci-esque vibes. So I got two pair of loafers. This one just so happens to go with the next look. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on. And the next look I'm gonna give you guys is a play on menswear, which you guys know is super on trend. I've styled this suit for you guys before from H&M. So let me step back. So it's kind of like a monochromatic look with the mules. And ooh, these are super comfortable. Oh my God. These are super comfortable, y'all. So as you guys know, men usually wear trench coats over their suits. So I wanted to do like a play on that. This is very much work wear, very much that mask femme trend that's going on very new york new york is my favorite city i should be number one in new york <sighs> yeah ma. you can put some shades on and the purse Y'all, these shoes are so comfortable, y'all. Like, I literally just opened them up. So, you could definitely can wear a trench over a suit. You could also do this with sneakers. Like, as the weather is changing, you can switch out the mules for some sneakers. I think that'd be cute with this look. I actually think, I love this as, like, a monochromatic look. But I think this will really be cute, like over a darker suit. I just wanted you guys to get the aesthetic. But I think that this will look cute, like over a navy suit or like a dark charcoal gray or even black. But this is like super monochromatic if you wanted to do a monochromatic look. Let me open up these other loafers up. Hold on. So, I like a black pair too. And I will link um, the loafers below and the blazer when I show you guys the blazer. So these are the black ones. Let me see how the black ones feel. I got both pair in a size 10. Oh, the black ones feel good too. So, 
This is what the black looks like. Okay. All right, let's get into the next look, y'all. Okay, you guys, so I just have on a white button-up shirt, some folded leggings, and I put on the black mules. Put the trench back on, same purse. So this outfit is super simple, super casual. But as you guys can see, the trench coat is making it a little bit more chic. And the loafers, I feel like gives it like a more elevated touch. So, what do you guys think? Are you guys filming the trench coat? Do you guys want to get a trench coat now? These loafers, I'm not even going to hold you. It's super comfortable. So, this is the last look, you guys. But, let's open up the blazer that I also got from Shein. First of all, this is not the color that's on the website. It's like this sea foamy green on the website. It looks more gray. And this is like really slim. This is why I don't this is why I don't do these other stores. Let me see how this looks. Hold on, y'all. Okay, guys, this is how the blazer looks from Shein. So the color isn't bad, but on the site, it looks gray, like a dark gray. What attracted me to it was the sleeves. But I thought this was gonna be like that other Shein blazer that I had that has like that house two print on it. It's a little bit more structured. This is super flimsy. It feels like a shirt. Um, like that's how flimsy it is. I mean, the aesthetic of it looks cute, like me looking at it, but this is not what I was expecting. Could I make it work? Yeah. But, um, I don't know. Then this is not staying. I probably have to iron this or something. I don't know. The aesthetic of it is cute, but it's not what's it's not giving what it was given on the website. Um and it feels like a microfiber type of material. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. If y'all see this in a styling video, then that means I can figure something out. But you definitely cannot wear anything thick under it. You would definitely have to wear it like a sleeveless tank top or a very thin long sleeve shirt and i got this in a 3x so i will link it below for anyone that's interested i will link the trench coat below i will link the loafers below i'm happy with the loafers both there um but this i don't know but this is the end of the video y'all if you made it to the end i love you guys thank you so much we now have the community tab so i can push out ideas for you guys there and do polls and whatever we're getting close to 1k yay right so let me know in the comments if you guys are going to get a trench what did you think about the looks that i did with the trench coat until the next one bye y'all